Historical Society, we are happy to answer your history collections questions. Today's comes from Mrs. Parkhurst's fourth grade class who was studying the American Revolution. What I brought out today are two powder horns. These would be carried in battle um, or perhaps when that particular soldier was hunting as well. Anytime he needed to fire his musket, he would need um, several items um, to prepare for firing. Um, in each particular musket, there would have been a small explosion that was required to send out the, the ball or the metal bullet. And in doing so, he would have to keep that powder dry. He could do that with these powder horns this is actually made out of a cow's horn. You can see the shape there. Um, it was waterproof, had a wooden stopper at one end, and then at the other end, it would have mm, often a little metal cap or a funnel that he could measure with, and then a wooden stopper at the end. There would be a long strap that he would carry across his chest or over his shoulder, and he would definitely need this going into battle. Um, between the beginning and the end of uh, firing uh, a musket to prepare it, it would take about a minute to measure all of the pieces, put everything in place, and then actually fire. It would take about a minute, and that gives us our um, label for what we call the Minutemen at the time of the American Revolution. So we are happy to answer your, uh, your questions. Uh, thank you very much.